Hello, my name is Caitlin with Bus Palm Dog, and today I'm here at Max, and we're doing a loose leash walking exercise. Now, today we're in the patio, and that's because we've got a major distraction that's a little bit off camera, and that's we got a bunch of Max's friends playing in the pool. And as you can see, there's a huge distraction to Max because not only is he seeing other dogs, which is already a massive distraction, but he's seen them run back and forth in clear view. You can especially see them on this back door right here. But we're gonna take advantage of that situation and walk Max nearby. Now what this is going to allow us to do is it's going to allow us to walk Max near really distracting snares without him pulling or dragging. No matter what the snare is, we don't allow any pulling or dragging on our walk. So what we're gonna do is we're just going to walk around the patio, like I said, past these distractions. And the goal here is that no matter what, Max is going to give us a very polite walk. Max, let's go. Come on. Right off the bat, he's doing a great job. You see he's given a lot of eye contact. Now we're gonna go ahead past one of the clear doors, which has some dogs walking past it. You can see right off the bat, Max is glancing out the door, but you see he's still remaining a nice even pace. Good boy, Max. And we're gonna do a few more laps on that. And like I said, this is a huge distraction. Just seeing dogs running back and forth would catch anyone's attention. And of course, a dog's attention. So this is a really tough exercise, especially with him being so close to the store. We're just mere feet away from it. Come in. Good job, Max. Come in. Now what this exercise is going to allow us to do, like I said, it's going to allow Max to walk through distraction snares such as a dog park without any fuss, because that's what we want. See right there, you see he's looking back and forth. Yes, good boy. And I'm gonna go ahead and say yes, every time Max is giving me eye contact, because we always wanna encourage that, it's much better that a dog is giving us eye contact than pulling ahead. I'm gonna make last turn right here. And when I want to stop with Max, I'm just going to go ahead and say his name. Max. Yes, good boy. And you see he gave me a very polite stop. And that was a really nice job for Max. You could see he did a great job. He was walking very politely. The only thing is that he was glancing back and forth from the door. But that's okay as he didn't stop the walk. Overall, really nice job for Max. Let's go. Good job, Max. I know. Good job.